Hi friends, welcome to Startup Talk series. In this video, I'm going to talk about what is banking as a service or white label banking. Basically, what is banking as a service? Banking as a service is an end-to-end -end model that allows digital banks or brands to connect with banking system using APIs so that they can provide the financial services. This is the statement. Let me explain with a simple example. Before talking about banking as a service, let's see the other service providers. For example, infrastructure as a service, platform as a service, function as a service, software as a service. So these are the different types of service providers. Say for example, I have a software company, I develop a software product and I want to deploy this software product in infrastructure. So I go to AWS, Google or Azure. So they provide the infrastructure to me so that I can deploy my application. So this is an example for infrastructure as a service. I don't have an infrastructure, but AWS can provide the infrastructure so that I can run my application on it. So I pay a little bit of money for utilizing their infrastructure. So similar to that platform as a service, function as a service and software as a service. For software as a service, Dropbox or Gmail we are using, it's entirely a software has been given to us so that we can use this software. So similar to these service providers, we also have banking as a service. So here you can see brands, banking as a service provider, license holder and some financial use cases. So here we have a brand. Say for example, I am having a luxury hotel and customers are booking rooms in my hotel. So I'm giving an option to pay the money. Say for example, they are trying to book a hotel room for one week and it costs two lakhs. So I'm giving an option to my customer. They can pay it now or they can also pay through installments, say six months or one year. So it makes my customer's life little comfortable. As a hotel industry owner, how can I support this installment payments i cannot do it because because my domain is hotel industry so i have to get some help from banking as a service provider so i go to banking as a service provider and i'm asking could you please help me to collect this money from a customer in installments for example six months or one year so they are going to provide apis and take care of getting the money from my customer in installments another question is as a brand why should i do this what is the benefit the benefit is the sales will grow if i give this option if you want to pay it now or later i'll get more customers the sales growth will be more instead of getting 10 customers per week i might get 30 customers per week so that's the one of the main benefit brands are going to banking as a service to enable this option so brands might be luxury hotel car industry or it might be any domain so this is how the banking as a service works remember there are three main components in banking as a service the first one is brands or fintechs who are going to consume the banking as service provider api and the next one is licensed bank who is going to take responsibility for core transactions the next question is how the banking as a service providers are going to earn money the revenue model whenever the brands are accessing the banking as a service provider apis so they will be paying as a monthly charge that's how the bass companies are earning the money or the brands will pay based on the service used here i'm giving a list of companies who are banking as a service provider as far as i know there are totally 172 companies around the world so i'm going to give the link to the list of companies you can go through them in the website apart from that if you know any other companies which are banking as a service provider please let me know in the comment friends i've shared basic information about what is banking as a service hope this small information is helpful all the best for your career please subscribe to interview.channel thank you